Hello, science friends. It's Justin Higgins with Minutes of Teaching. Today, we're going to discuss a misconception that the moon does not rotate on its axis because we only see one face of the moon from anywhere on Earth. And we're going to prove that the moon rotates on its axis by using something you can eat, a marshmallow. For this activity, you're going to need a marshmallow. And I'm using the big jumbo ones because they're a little bit more easy to see what's going on a pen, preferably non-toxic. If you are using a toxic pen, whatever face you end up drawing on is gonna taste really nasty. And something to put your marshmallow on. I'm gonna use a kebab skewer, but you could use a pencil or anything else that you can poke through the marshmallow. Choose one of the flat sides. That's gonna be the face of the moon that always faces the earth. And we need something to represent that. So why don't we just Draw a face so that I can tell when I do the proof to myself that this face, although it is always facing the Earth, is indeed turning on its axis at the same time that it's going around the Earth. Take my skewer and put it at a right angle to my face. And I'm ready to do this and demonstrate it. So your eyeballs, they're going to represent all of the observers on Earth, all of humans. And humans only ever see one side of the moon, the face of the moon. Now point your face towards you and turn in a full circle on your axis. Did the face, did the moon rotate on its axis when you turned? Now your first impulse is to say, no, no, it didn't. It didn't turn around because I kept on seeing the same part all the time. But think about an observer outside of you. Your face is facing behind you. When you turn, although the face is still facing behind you, the face had to turn around 180 degrees in order for you to still be seeing the same face. So, as the moon goes around the Earth, the moon rotates on its axis at the same rate that it goes around the Earth in order for it to spin on its axis and for us to only see one side. Hmm. The moon completes a full orbit of the Earth about every 28 days. In that 28 days, the moon will rotate on its axis once. The fact that the moon's face is always facing the Earth is tidal locking, and the action of the moon's movement compared to the Earth is synchronous rotation. If the moon was not tidally locked with the Earth, we would see different parts of the moon as the Earth rotated on its axis and as the moon went around the Earth. Thank you for watching, and science is in everything. Um, I shouldn't have bit the part with the ink.